chilling in our bathroom. Welcome to the vlog. We've officially made it to our freaking honeymoon, which is so exciting. So we are actually in St. Lucia at the Sandals Grand. It's our first sandals ever. Um, this is an all-inclusive resort. This one in particular is massive, so that's one of the reasons we were attracted to it. Other than the fact that it's fucking gorgeous and this is the most exquisite, like extravagant suite we've ever stayed in. So this is like a private butler service rendezvous, I think it's called. So this is our own like private room, our own little hut. Uh, we got prime location. Like we are the first ones right on the beach, which is absolutely incredible. We couldn't ask for anything more. So we literally just landed. We're starving right now. So we're gonna go get some dinner, figure that out, and then just walk around and explore this resort. I can't wait to take you guys through this resort and share this special week with us and take you along for the ride. So we could not be more excited to be here. Morning Hi. guys. <laughs> Morning guys. So I didn't film too much last night, but we basically just hung out in the room. We did use the hot tub, which was awesome. And we ordered like a cheese platter and Brian got a BLT. So far, the butler service has been incredible. Um, essentially, if you guys are ever gonna think about coming here and you do wanna do the butler service, this is our first time ever doing this at, at an all-inclusive. So if you guys are ever considering doing the butler service, they're on from 7 a.m. to 10 p.m., which is awesome. So we have our own like cell phone and we can call them at any time. Um, they've been amazing. So they've booked like all of our restaurants for the week. They already put out towels at the pool for us and they give you like a little cooler of your favorite drinks. So you can fill all that out online before you come. So today's Tuesday, we're gonna take full advantage. We've only been here for a couple hours. Sleep was great. This bed is amazing. Um, you can control like the fans, obviously temperature, all that good stuff. But yeah, now I think we're just gonna go hang by the pool. I wanna read, I wanna relax. I did a couple emails this morning, um, but so far it's been amazing. Ryan opened the door and Kitty came with Come on, let's go. Let's go. All right, we gotta go. <laughs> A few hours later. All right, fam, we just had pizzas. It's like 3.30 now. I just had a French vanilla latte, which was heavenly. So the sun finally came out. I'm gonna go show you outside because we're finally gonna sit and get some sun. So come out here. We've got our glorious little jacuzzi tub. Brian's hanging in here in our little pool. So we, it's cold. <laughs> and we just set up our chairs. We've got a little waterfall. Do you mind being on video? Is that okay? Of Say hello, this is Yannick. Hi. <laughs> He's enjoying. <laughs> Guys, this limoncello martini is bomb. Lemon drop martinis in. Like 7.25 a.m. I want to say, which is like 6.25 a.m. New Jersey time and I'm walking over to the gym so I wanted to like get some fitness in this week. I'm just gonna go walk on the treadmill, like get that routine started and then hopefully have a beautiful day. It was just raining. I don't know which way I'm going. I think it's this way. <laughs> uh, it was just raining so everything's like wet and beautiful here but this I think they said this island's like 75% rainforest so it makes sense but hopefully it's a beautiful sunny beach day and it'll be perfect. Yet again, we just came back from breakfast and I almost just took my finger off trying to pop the champagne, but it's been most of the time. He has Bloody Mary mix in the room. He just isn't having any today. All right, I have to show you how cute this is. So last night we did dinner at the Italian restaurant, which was chef's kiss, so good. 
Um, and then afterwards, they did like Broadway show tunes. It was like an hour long show that was awesome. I like Broadway. Bri, what do you think of the show? Beautiful. <laughs> Beautiful. It was so good. I had like four lemon drop martinis. Actually, I had two lemoncello martinis at the Italian place, which were fantastic. And then I had two lemon drop martinis. Got a little lit. And then we came back and they like ran us a bath with like little rose petals in it. And then they spelled out lovers. How cute is that? But this was on the bed where he is. I think it's made for it, no? Probably. How beautiful. Or that didn't last long. Uh oh, it's seeping through here. Well, now what? Sailing along. <laughs> Say hello. Hello. <laughs> Brian's doing all the work right now. I'm just filming. We're gonna go past the water bungalows up ahead. Okay, I gotta put this down. I gotta oh, start pedaling. Hey. <laughs> We finally got sun. Hello. Say good morning. Hello, Governor. We're under like one of these little huts today. Ooh, hopefully that's not loud from the wind, but good morning guys. It's Thursday. We were posted up under this little like hut thing today. Um, it's still cloudy every morning, but we were seeing the sun pop through here. It's absolutely gorgeous. Today, today we're just hanging again, doing another beach day, keeping it low key. But tomorrow we have this like piton snorkeling and sunset cruise so we're gonna be out from like 1 p.m. to 7 30 p.m. so it's like kind of one of our last beach days just to do freaking nothing you know what I'm saying I've got these little buns today I look like a child Great. what do you think of vacation so far it's very relaxing <laughs> which been your favorite part sitting down doing nothing <laughs> okay good love you all right guys so this is where we're at it's been a minute <laughs> since I've updated you the sun is out and shining we're feeling freaking good um, Basically, we did nothing all day again today, and it's been perfection. You probably can't hear me with that freaking fountain. Hold on one second. I'm just hanging out here now. I'm watching the Call Her Daddy and Emma Chamberlain episode, which I'm very excited about. My laptop's probably overheating. We swam a little. Whew. Okay, hopefully it's a little quieter over here. We swam, we did the beach, we hung out in one of those like little tube things over the water drank, ate, all of the things, and I feel amazing. Definitely very burned. I'm feeling very sunburnt today, but is it four o'clock? Yeah, it's like 4.15, so this is the perfect time like to just hang in our room, which is one of the nicest things about this like choice of room is we have our own space that's very private. So we did the same thing yesterday. We came back here around like 3.34. So we're just hanging out. Brian's taking a nap. But yeah, that's the update for right now. Um, tonight we are doing Bombay, which is the Indian restaurant. It's all the way on the other side of the resort. Um, near the restaurant Soy, which is sushi, and then there's a hibachi restaurant I can't remember the name of, but we haven't even been over there yet, so we're doing that. There's a cabaret show tonight. We definitely want to check that out, and then they have this like old English pub here, which we haven't been in, but we don't have any dinner scheduled there, but I do want to like pop in just to check it out, so that is the game plan for the rest of the day. Sunset action here.
Hello, kitty. Hello. She's so pretty. Brian's up. <laughs> Morning. Doors. <laughs> Living our best lives, guys. Hi, guys. Okay, I haven't checked in at all yet today, but we're about to head over to the Piton Sunset and Snorkeling Cruise. So this is like the only excursion we're doing all day, but it's gonna be like 1 p.m. to 7 or 7.30 p.m. So we're gonna be out all day snorkeling, right? Enjoying the sights. <laughs> I think they're gonna give you like food and drinks on it too, which should be good, but yeah, we'll see what happens. Guys, what is going on in here? I, kid, the cat is here. <laughs> Good morning, you guys. We are absolutely roasted and fucking live in here. But I think last time I checked in, we were a little tipsy last night after our boosters, which was beautiful. Good experience, Brian? Very good. Yeah, it was awesome. We like met another couple who was really nice and had plenty of drinks on the way back and the weather ended up clearing up and it was actually really nice. I'm glad we did get off that, like get off the island for a little bit. Um, but yeah, no, we did our COVID test this morning. So we're waiting for our results to come back. We've got a cute little cabana on the beach here and we're just hanging out and enjoying our last day here, which is so sad. We've got a couple clouds in the sky, but it's absolutely gorgeous. This is the book that I've been reading, The Underground is Massive, which is awesome so far. Tons of history about the electronic music scene and the history of everything. So I'm about like that way through. Really, really good though. Heavenly. All right, you guys, are you ready to see the final sunset of our vacation, which is like, it hurts my heart to say that because I do not want to leave here because it's absolutely paradise, but there's all these boats like pulled up here on the shoreline, so I'll show you, but this is what we've been doing all day. We did the beach, and then we came back here for the last like three hours, and we've just been lounging and hanging out, and Brian's been swimming. Look how gorgeous. So, got literally all these boats pulled up here. And it's absolute perfection outside. Could not be more gorgeous. As we eat our last meal of the trip, his favorite French onion soup. You got your little steak. It's ready to eat. <laughs> All right, guys, this is where I leave you. So sad, honestly, but we're ready to go home. I woke up this morning and I was like, okay, I'm ready to go home. I don't think I can eat or drink anymore, um, but it's a beautiful day. So we're just about to check out and then there's a free shuttle bus that takes you to the airport. So I think it's like an hour and a half drive. So we'll probably just hang out and sleep. Overall, incredible experience. I was our first sandals, first time in St. Lucia. Highly recommend this resort. This is the grand. Um, Beautiful resort, honestly, food was amazing. Drinks were still really strong because that's some inclu all inclusives. The drinks are like, mm, um, all that was good. 
Butler service, incredible. Yannick, Nikizma, and Giselle were amazing. In general, highly recommend this. Um, I think the only cons we said really is like when you're on the beach area, you do get approached a lot throughout the day. So whether it's like people selling excursions or the spa or whatever else, if you're on the beach or by the pool, like you do get interrupted a lot. So that's the only thing that's like, I wish we weren't bothered as much as we were. But other than that, the catamaran, the piton, Sunset and Snorkel Cruise was really fun. We're glad we did at least one excursion. Um, and then favorite restaurant? I don't know, the Italian was really, really good. This was good. And the hibachi was bomb. And I think a lot of the sandals have very similar restaurants, so you'll get similar experiences at all of these. But overall, gorgeous weather. So happy we did this and went all out for our honeymoon. We will never spend as much money on a, honey or on a vacation ever again, but we will be back at a sandals. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Uh, it's a little different than what I do on my channel, but I'm glad you guys got to experience our honeymoon with us. It's been amazing. So thank you for watching. If you're new here, I would love it if you would hit the subscribe button down below. Uh, give this video a thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel or you just happen to stumble upon this because you're watching Sandals vlogs, uh, welcome as well. I hope you stick around. So I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Fall into you.